Nationally ranked number five Jenny Soccer starting the 2017 season at home in Warrensburg hosting Southwestern Oklahoma State. The team picked to win the Great American Conference this year. This is an in-region game for the Gents. UCM gets on the board in the 13th minute of this match when Courtney Killian sends the ball in. Abby Rhodes brings it down then chips it over the keeper for the first goal of the season. Jenny's get out to a 1-0 lead. Gonna get another one in the first half. Michaela Toth with a nice little pass in front of the goal. Jada Scott is a step ahead of her. Defender flicks in the score. 27th minute, it's 2-0 UCM. At halftime, the Jennies have the same lead and they're out shooting Southwestern Oklahoma 13-6. But the Bulldogs are a good team. They took some good shots. UCM keeper Anna Dilks made five saves in the first half. Second half now, Jens keep finding opportunities. Rhodes dribbles right up to the front of the box, takes a shot. It goes right into the far corner for her second goal of the game. In the 55th minute, it's now 3-0 UCM. Handball in the box in the 69th minute on the visitors. UCM freshman Mallory Brody takes the PK, then scores her first goal of her career. Jenny's finish it off. Number five, Central Missouri top Southwestern Oklahoma State 4-0 in the season opener. Rhodes says it was important for the team to play their kind of game. It feels really good to get the first game and the first win out of the way. Um, coming out, we were kind of um, really focused. I mean, we had seen what they had done in years past, but uh, all in all, we wanted to make sure that we just stuck to what we do. And I think um, we kind of have some weight lifted off our shoulders and we have momentum hopefully going into the game on Sunday. The Jins took 10 more shots in the second half, ended up out shooting the Bulldogs 23 to 10. Dilks had seven saves total in the match and she picked up career shutout number 44. Dilks is now the MIAA all-time leader in shutouts. Next couple of games for the Jins are on the road. They'll be back in Warrensburg September 15th. Reporting for UCMAthletics.com, I'm Katie Richardson.